Good morning, students. Good morning, sir. Today, we are going to read about a grammar part. And that is degrees of comparison. What we are going to read today? Degrees of comparison. So the subject is English and topic is degrees degrees of comparison degrees of comparison there are three types of this degree how many types three types can you please tell me what are the types what are the there are three types but what are the three types positive degree first is positive degree second one anyone comparative degree and third is the superlative degree superlative degree there are three types of degree how many types three types, three types. Three types. first one is positive degree second one comparative degree and last superlative degree positive degree shows the simple quality positive degree shows the comparative degree shows the higher quality and superlative degree shows the highest quality very good it shows the simple quality of a man or thing and this shows the higher quality and this one highest quality so this degree of comparison is connected with it is linked with adjective it is linked with adjective because with the help of the adjective we describe the noun or other thing and the quality is exhibited or quality is shown so here we take the help of one adjective tall taller and taller tall taller taller could you please tell me which one is positive degree tall and comparative degree and superlative degree tallest because it shows the highest or a highest quality of a person or thing so positive degree describes about simple quality comparative higher quality superlative highest quality how will you recognize that whether this is positive degree or comparative degree when in a sentence you see show as or as as then you will understand that this sentence belongs to positive degree for example pooja is pooja is not so tall as rakhi so here so as is used so it is a positive degree now comparative degree c is better than rakhi it becomes comparative degree and superlative degree william shakespeare is the greatest dramatist so you found that in positive degree show as or as as is used in comparative degree first we give the comparative form of what comparative form of adjective and plus t h a n t 
then is used. And in superlative degree, what is used? THE plus highest quality of adjective. Sometimes adverbs are also used in it. Hmm? For example, near, nearer, nearest. Soon, sooner, soonest. Late, later, latest. So it also shows the quality uh, of uh, noun thing with the help of adjective and with the help of adverb. Sometimes there are some words that in comparative degree don't take the help of th, a and then, but they take the help of to. In different competitive examinations it is asked as inferior, superior, interior, senior, junior, etc. Okay? So this way, today we learned how to recognize whether the particular sentence is in positive degree or comparative degree or superlative degree. How will you recognize? And we will also learn that how you can change or transform positive degree into comparative degree. Comparative degree into superlative degree. So here we will we just we get one example and you will understand it very clearly. See one sentence age. Ram H as good as Sham. This is in comparative degree. Huh? Tell me. Is it in comparative degree or positive degree? Positive degree. Very good. This is the positive degree. I denote it with PD. Positive degree. And what would be comparative degree? Anyone can tell me? Start from here. Siam. Siam. Siam is not better than Ram. Siam is not better than Ram. So this becomes a comparative degree. And from this positive degree, we made this comparative. Superlative degree is possible if in the sentence positive degree begins with no other or very few. If it begins with no other, then D plus superlative degree will be used. And if it becomes with very few, then most other it changes into most other and one of the is worst. Okay? Thank you. You understood it? Okay.